Wait, you telling me you built a time machine out of a DeLorean? Good morning, girls. It's Monday. Sorry about last week. I've been having what amounts to a horrible year so far. Um, and last week was just like probably the worst week of it so far. So, um, yeah, I'm sorry I didn't make a video. I really, I was just in a bad space last week. So, uh, I'm really sorry and I'm glad that um, you guys understand and uh, glad to be making a video this week. This week's theme is to vlog about our lives, and mine kind of sucks right now, so this may be a fairly depressing, um, video. Uh, the worst thing that's happened this week, I guess, is, uh, I have an external hard drive that I keep most of my computer on, and, uh, I took it to Best Buy because it wasn't working, and they told me that it was dead, and that it would cost me, uh, over a thousand dollars to get everything recovered off of it, and what's on there is my complete writing portfolio, and I've been looking for a job, and for this job I need my writing portfolio, so I'm just stuck in this place that I can't get out of. And um, thankfully I googled myself, um, and I found a blog that I had like two years ago, and um, it had a whole bunch of my writing on it, so I have some of it saved, and I think I have a thumb drive at my parents' house that I might be able to, um, that might have stuff on it. So. Hopefully I didn't lose everything, but if I have the thumb drive, it's, like, first and second drafts and not, like, the stuff that was saved on my hard drive, which I, I need it. So, try to figure out how to do that, and, yeah. So, it's been quite a fun, quite a fun year, if that's, uh. Megan mentioned in her video about her ankle, and, uh, I want to tell my ankle story, because it's awesome. Uh, when I was 16 or 15, I was a sophomore in high school, we were running for volleyball, and we used to run around the, um, the school, basically, the neighborhood that the school's in, and there aren't any sidewalks in the town I grew up in, because there aren't. Well, there's one. It's on a bridge. I don't know. But uh, we were running, and I was on this side, and my friend was on this side, and we were running, and a car was coming this way, and she moved over and pushed me off the road, and my ankle went like this and like snapped and was gross, but I continued to play the rest of the volleyball season on my ankle. And um, then I played Junior Olympic volleyball <laughs> on my ankle. And in April, I discovered, we found out that it was stress fractured. So I was in a walking cast from April to June, or July. And then I was in a regular cast from July until like almost September. And um, then they took it off and my foot still goes like this because it didn't heal right. And then my ankle's pretty much still broken. So that's my fun ankle story. It's, uh, yeah, I have to wear, like, two braces most of the time. And, uh, it hurts, like, always, but mostly when it rains and snows and when it's really cold and really hot. So there's no, there's no happy time for my ankle. So, yeah. <laughs> this week's challenge is to do something different, so I'm going to read you guys some poems that I wrote. And I hope that you enjoy them. The first one's called Shift Away. Um, I watched the birds chip away, the last of his bones. Was death always this cruel? Slowly I lean back into my own awaiting doom. The door closes, darkness settles. It's not at all as I pictured. The darkness is almost company, comforting. But then again, I always liked being alone. The second one is called Nothing. Uh, the walls close slowly around. No hand to catch me as I fall into nothingness. I'm haunted by the knowledge of my own horrid acts. My soul means nothing. The axe handle is heavier than I once thought, but dead is nothing. The beating heart of the past clouds my mind, but yet it's nothing. I lead them to their demise, cold hard, cold hard rooms await before they are nothing. If you enjoyed those poems, I happen to have a rebook page where I'm writing a novel, and I would really like it if you guys check that out. Um, I don't have any poems on there right now, so I didn't even know I had them saved anywhere. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> um, so check those out if you guys would like, and, uh, Laura, I would really like to thank you, uh, you know what for, but thank you so much, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.